YouTube is fucking broken. Now, I know I said I was going to try and avoid these rant videos for my main channel, but since this has to do with gaming in general, I figure it might be able to pass the bar. You might be sitting there in Gundam, what the fuck are you talking about? You're on about YouTube being broken again? Because it is. Alright? Now there's this Rebel chick, or Reb Yellow, I don't know what the fuck her name is. I should probably Google translate it to be somewhat cool. If you don't, get off my nuts, motherfucker, when I'm pontificating. There will be death for you, you small furry fuck. Rubel. Okay. So her name is Rubel. Whatever. Uh, she's been on YouTube for since 2016. Forgive me. So not very long. Uh, she's a typical girl streamer. You know, the kind that, you know, they're not willing to go that next step like Zoe Berger and Sniper Wolf where it's all boobs and great lighting and stuff. She just sits there. She plays her PlayStation and even the camera is shitty the mic sounds horrible but the thing is she sits there for like I don't know an hour or two sometimes four hours streaming I haven't sat through this whole stream to see if she really sits and plays for four hours straight I doubt it though and anyway since the new YouTube algorithm is hit you know this girl's channel has exploded now beforehand she had 15k subs and with 15k subs she was lucky to see 800 to 2,000 views per video kind of gives you an idea and every thumbnail is a picture of her gigantically you know trying to be cute and seductive in some of these photos I mean that's what she's going with she's like I'm a girl I'm cute I'm going to run with it and she will be rewarded now the YouTube algorithm is hit she's gone from having videos that barely made it to 2k to 5k to 10k they even started promoting her Grand Theft Auto videos. Like, oddly enough, it was on my stream, all the, like, my stuff all the time. I'm, like, going through, I'm looking at tech stuff. Maybe you like Rubel. I'm like, who the fuck is this? I click it, the video in 23 hours has 100k views. She's had more views in this one video than her entire YouTube career. Just because YouTube's like, oh, she's on for a couple hours, this is what people want. This is the new algorithm. This is what we're trying to sell. Like, what the fuck? Honest to God, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna lie to you, all right? I'm a guy who can get laid, therefore a woman needs to have more than a pulse for me. But usually, it, it, it's just kind of ridiculous, there's nothing really here. What's the difference between this Rubel chick and Omega Primus for instance? Both of them have a two hour stream, both of them have a really shitty setup, both of them are on PS4. The difference is one has breasts and the other one doesn't. Unknowingly, YouTube has just created the next fucking stream girl. Thanks, YouTube. You can't promote my shit, but I'll be damned if you don't shove some broad down my throat. What will you? Because this is obviously great content. <laughs> Guys, look at that hashtag. <laughs> Let's see the comments. All right, it's people trying to add her gamer tag. That's lonely guys. I mean, really, if a chick plays video games and you get her gamer tag, do you really want to add her? Like, really? What do you think's gonna come of this? You're gonna play games together and have a great time? She's just gonna one day realize you're an awesome dude and you two should see each other, and then you'll fall in love? Is that the thought process? You're fucking me, Gundam. You're right. I'm reality. Nobody likes reality. You are a real pretty girl, Rubel. I hope you do some more. I wish I was your friend. Jesus Christ. You're really cute, no joke. I discovered your channel and Miss Rubel. It is so fun watching you play GTA 5. You're awesome, keep up the great work. Add me on PS. Are you single? You are so hot. Hi. Jesus Christ. It's just like a legion of lonely losers. I mean, that's what this is. Fuck, thanks YouTube. You've just created the next Zoe Burger, except unlike Zoe Burger, where at least Zoe Burger is willing to commit to nudity and all this other stuff, exploiting her sexuality. This girl's just gonna like take a couple cute photos of her DSLR, pin the photo to the video, and then when you watch the video, the stream is so low quality, her web camera is so low quality, and there's still someone jerking off to it. And in the long run, you promote this and make people's channels bigger. But then you have guys like me busting our dicks on a regular basis making moderately decent content. I mean, really, the quality speaks for itself. And I get to fall off into the endless abyss of nothingness. Thanks, YouTube. Why don't you tell me more about PewDiePie having a fucking mustache, you dicks?
This girl is the type of chick you can tell by looking at her that when some guy she doesn't like or give a fuck about gives her a compliment, she's the type of girl that would sit there and go, oh my god, you're so nice. You're too good to me. Because they know if they say anything too nice, loser guys like fall in love with them and start chasing them everywhere like fucking lap dogs. I swear to god, I don't know how the fuck feminists can run around and say shit like, America is as fair as a patriarch, it's all about men and they have all the power and even I mean, bullshit. You're right that everything isn't fair because women have it easier than guys and if you don't have it easier than a guy then you're probably an ugly chick and you need to reevaluate your skill set. Meaning, don't fucking study to be a psychiatrist unless you plan on doing it for a living and don't do gender studies. You better learn how to weld, bitch. That's just how it works. I'm looking into welding myself. <laughs> Learn a trade. Cute chicks, they can cruise through life. Oh my god, can an attractive girl cruise through life? I used to think when I was a kid, cute girls cruise through life before. Not like now. Oh my god, a cute girl now, if she has any level of cognitive ability, she knows she can get on the internet, set up a web camera, and play a video game, and just make money sitting there. She doesn't even have to like the game, and she can make money. All you have to do is make the fuck nut on the other and think that he is a shot with you. Like, oh, you like video games? So do I. <laughs> You're so pretty. <laughs> Please notice me. What's your gamer tag so I can add you? Like, really, dude? Really? Think about this shit logically. If you are on the internet watching a girl and you're asking her what her gamer tag is, you have no shot now. Do you think guys who nail these chicks, the first thing they say at a club or at a party is, what's your gamer tag? No. Oh, God. The, the males of today are so confused. I'm surprised they still have dicks and they haven't fallen off. Ooh. Well, that's going to do it for me because I'm tired of trying to look up all this stuff and make the video interesting and show these points and so on and so forth because I know most people sit there and go, he's just so jealous and stupid. And they won't see the artistry of my anger. And my, my, my soul is weeping. You don't understand. I try so hard for love and kisses and no one will give it to me. So I gotta headbutt them in the fucking face until their lips split open like Jean-Claude Van Damme in the movie Lionheart. Okay, that didn't happen in Lionheart. <laughs> <coughs> oh, well, that's gonna do it for me. I I've had enough cancer today. I mean, I can't force myself to look through any more of these videos to find little clips or wacky, ridiculous, sad, lonely comments. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you as always for tuning into my channel. Feel free to share my angry ass so maybe I can get a following. And then I can be big enough to take my complaints to YouTube, which they probably won't give a fuck about, but let's face it, wouldn't it be funny if it was me and PewDiePie on a talk show as I chewed into his asshole at the side of the chair? Imagine that, Conan O'Brien has PewDiePie on and me, as I sit at the back and Conan does a joke and then I do a punchline and I look at Felix and go, see, that's called comedy. But you wouldn't know anything about that because you're too busy doing your brand of shit snackery. Oh wait, I don't think that's, fuck, you can't say that on TBS. Fries, motherfucker. I am on fire. You're up. Get in there. I am on fire.